Got beans? Get beans. Burder Butter Beans Studio. You know who it is? Hey guys, it's Burder Butter Beans Studio, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can redeem your Xbox Game Pass Ultimate one month subscription and start playing some of the latest games. So, um, first, you want to go to the start menu and type Windows. And then click on the Microsoft Store. Let that load. And click the search. Type Xbox. Click Enter. This is the one you want to get. Um, something to note too is that you can get Xbox Game Pass Ultimate for $1. Um, the caveat is, is it has to be a new account. Um, that you haven't redeemed before but um, in this case I'll show you how to install the app that has both the PC and the cloud games so click on Xbox and if you don't have it installed click install and then you can open so the user interface is pretty nice too um, if it says your Microsoft Store account is different from your Xbox account just click here to review them and then for whatever account you're trying to redeem uh, the code for you want to set that as your store account so now you can click on your profile in the top left and click settings and you'll see a redeem a code here click redeem and I got one right here Click Next. Might take a second. All right, so make sure you have a payment method. Uh, you won't need to pay. I'll show you. I'll show you how to turn off recurring pay uh, payments. So I have PayPal set as my default payment method. You can click Confirm. All right, welcome to Game Pass. Click Close. And now I'll show you what to do on the browser. So click on your browser, go to xbox.com. Make sure you're signed in with the same account you redeemed. Click your profile picture and click My Microsoft Account. And then click on Manage next to Xbox Game Pass Ultimate. And then click on this one, Turn Off Recurring Billing. You can scroll down and click the blue Turn Off Recurring Billing. All right, this doesn't mean you lost your subscription. It just means it won't charge you again on, on this day right here. So you can go back to subscription and you'll see when it expires, April 20th for me. All right, so now we can go back to the Xbox app and you can start playing your games. So you'll see a recently added category here. And if you click all PC games, th these will show the ones you can download and install on your computer. There's a really big list. There's 438 games. Some games do leave Xbox Game Pass and some new ones come back on. Uh, you can also click the cloud gaming section. And you can play all of these games without having to connect. Just make sure you have a controller plugged in. And it will tell you that you have a controller. Let me just get one really quick. All right, ready to play with cloud. And uh, Dead Space 3 just got released. So if you're into horror games, then you can give that a try. Valheim, that seems like a popular game. Halo Infinite, there's so much to play from. If you're not quite sure what you're going to play, 
um, you can have the app uh, randomly generate one for you. Or at least that used to be a feature. Let's see, controller. All right, it looks like it chose Forza Horizon 4. And you, can, you see this little cloud icon, that means you can play it straight away in the cloud. So I hit that. You'll see this little rocket ship animation and you'll be straight in your game in no time. And it goes in full screen by default. And then if you want to quit the game, click on this on the top left. Click these three dots and hit quit game. All right, guys, so I hope you enjoyed. As a little bonus gift, I will be leaving a Xbox One Month Game Pass Ultimate code in the pinned comments, so be sure to check below. Uh, as a little thank you for um, watching my videos, so I hope to catch you in the next one. Thanks so much. You know who it is.